All right, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to the Gentleman TV. So we got Game Seven of the quarter conference quarterfinals, and um, they were actually dishing us that cool intro again for this game, which I thought was cool. They gave it to us in Game One, and now they're giving it to us in Game Seven. And I think they know this. We need that hype up, cause you know, Game One we brought it. Like we absolutely brought it, Game One. And, I mean, I think we need another game where we can bring it to a whole nother level out there. I'm not even going to let Dwight Howard finish his intro. I'm too hyped to get into this game. So, let's get into this. Dwight Howard, he's going to win that tip <laughs> up early in the game. I was like, oh, crap. I just breathed into my mic way too loud. Early in the game, we get that block. They're going to end up scoring on us anyway, though. Great shot right there. Eric Gordon getting the rebound. Dishing up to Kevin Love. Kevin Love, you can see he's cold right now. But he's going to jack up that three, and he's going to drain it. So, we're looking to get another big impact out of Kevin Love. Obviously, last game, Kevin Love made the huge impact, and Dwight Howard also making to make a, yeah, looking to make a big impact. Damn. Um, so our big man definitely going to be a big, big part of this game. Dwight Howard already shown that he's making a big impact on this game. He's ready to be big this game. I'm going to use the word big as many goddamn times as I can. I swear to God. We're going to go down by one right there, though. 14-13, Kings. And now we're, we got the one-point lead, though. Jimmer for debt, trying to get himself open for a three. He's going to fake me out, though, and dish it over to Brendan Bowen for the three. See, when Jimmer gets open in that three-point line, you got to be afraid in this game because that dude does not miss when he gets open. Eric Gordon with the ball, though, getting the screen right there. He's looking inside. He's Andrew. I'm not not Andrew Boga. David Lee. Andrew Boga was over there occupying the rest of the defense. Boga with the ball, though, dishing it to Lee, dishing it to Gordon, and a very nice transition play. Something I mentioned last video was I've been really trying to make a good transition game work, and uh, we've been doing it great. We've been definitely uh, jumping the passing lanes, which I want to see happen. Aggressive defense. A lot of pressure right there. The lack of pressure, though, is going to cause them to hit a jump shot. And now we're down by two. We're trying to stay in this game, though. That just mentality that we got to stay in this game is a good one to have. Missed shot right there. Daniel Wharton getting the ball back. And then we see Brian Harrison wide open from the top of the key. He's got that three ball right there. Now a three-point lead. We're staying in this game, definitely. And there's that little floater I've been talking about. Marcus Smart always hitting that floater. Randall York bringing it up, though. Dishing over to Kevin Love. I'm taking an awful jumper. I'm going to drain it, though. See, Kevin Love's hot. When Kevin Love gets hot, it transitions over games or something because he was complete ass for a few games out there, and now he's finally figured it out. On that play, draining, not draining, I'm sorry, just throwing that down on that dunk. But now we've got ourselves a three-point deficit. They're dishing it up. I'm trying to stop Macklemore. He's got the dish right there, and I can't stop it. I was kind of looking to put my hand up, but I accidentally jumped. So that was a bad mistake on my part. Then a sick lob right here. Jabari dishing it to Exum. We had a great one from Jabari to Harrison last game. And uh, looks like we're going to continue with these awesome lobs. And then as always, it seems like at the end of every uh, first or second quarter, we got a, a, uh, sorry, a last second shot. I can't even talk right now. But we're going to stop them right there. We got three-point deficit, but we got the game tied now in the second half. Exum inside. Kevin Love continuing to make a huge offensive impact. Kevin Love's not a great defender, but his offense has been really flowing recently, as you guys can tell. Kevin Love again wide open. And, I mean, I'm just taking whatever I can get with this guy. He's draining everything. You dish it to the guy with the hot hand. That's what I've learned in this game. There's a dude that's draining everything. You got to give it to him. Jabari Parker, though, he wants to take this one himself, and he's going to get the and one. That was just a filthy layup. I don't know what it was about it. Just making that acrobatic move with his wrist and getting that shot in. Then he's going to hit the layup. I mean, not the, oh, my God, the free throw. So uh, now we got a seven-point lead. Nice steal right there. Jabari up to Daniel Orton. I want Daniel Orton taking this. So I got Randall York wide open for the shot right there. Nine-point lead. And this game's starting to get out of hand. I don't think they can even stand a chance at this point. We're still uh, in the third quarter, though. We can't start to give up yet. We can't start to think we got this win. Obviously not. We only got a five-point lead in the third quarter. But we're going to see what we can do. Try to grow this lead. Brian Harrison with the ball. Trying to get a screen right there. Daniel Orton doesn't do a great job, but Jabari Parker, he didn't need the screen. Jabari Parker's going to drain that three. Eight-point lead. Jimmer driving in. I don't know how he didn't strip that ball out of his hands, but he's going to get that shot right there. Six-point game. Doing what we can right here to come back uh, and get this up to a double-digit lead. I'm sorry, not come back. To grow this lead. I'm so used to being down in these games. I can't stop saying come back. Andrew Bogut hitting the layup right there. I talked to you guys about Andrew Bogut's ability to hit get, uh, big shots right there. And I'm sorry, I can't even speak right now, guys. My bad, my bad. Two-point lead right now. Jimmer for death driving in. He's going to get the pass off. And his canter. He has made a huge impact on this uh, series. Late in the fourth. Not late in the fourth. 
Oh my sweet lord. Dishing up to Dwight Howard early in the fourth quarter. We got a two point lead. Dwight Howard getting inside for the layup. Four point lead for this team. And now we still got the three point lead. We just gotta maintain this. And now playing the best D I can on Smart and he's still gonna hit it. I jumped a little bit too early, so I mean I can't be expecting to stop that shot if I'm jumping too early. That's just something that you can't be doing. And Exum hitting, almost hitting a clutch shot. Sorry, not hitting. And uh, Macklemore going up on the break, trying to find somebody to give it to, and he's going to find Glenn Davis inside. Glenn Davis, though, a guy that has been hitting all his shots this series, not able to hit that one. Then Jabari taking it to the other end for the end one, and Jabari is going off. This dude is hyped. He is ready to go. Jabari hitting his free throw. Now we got the four-point lead, two possession. This is what I like to see. Five minutes left. Hold on to this lead a little bit longer. And Jabari, oh my god. Jabari cannot be stopped. Three and ones in this fourth quarter. I mean, I don't even know what to say. He's on some Andrew Wiggins shit right now. Good lord. Uh, somehow that pass gets through to Dante Axum. And Dante Axum throwing down. This is where I thought we had a Kia slam cam last time. Because there was a very similar dunk. And Dante Axum getting it right there. He gets his Kia slam cam finally. But Dante Axum's reign of terror is very short lived and this is going to be one of the most depressing parts of this season you're going to see right there he's on the floor and he's not getting up this defensive possession I knew Dante Axum was on the ground on the other end and it was just hard to play defense I knew this is not good and I'm playing a 4 on 5 game right now I just got to get this ball back they're eventually going to score here though and oh my god I'll just tell you the news now Dante Exum out for the season. That was not a mess up. I've been messing up enough in my commentary. That was not a mess up. Dante Exum torn MCL out for the rest of the season. And you know without Dante Exum's help, we're losing this lead. Brian Harrison, this is on some my career stuff. Like He just had this great chance to be a backup, but then this... Huge injury for Dante Axum is going to give him a chance to be a starter for a playoff contending, finals contending team. And uh, now it's a three-point game, and he might not even get that chance here if we can't get this. And it just does not look good at this point. He gets to be in this position where he gets to be a starter, and he just is going to blow it. It's just we don't – we can't hold on to this lead without Exum, and that's a proven fact. We can't ever hold on to our leads without Exum. So here we go. Marcus Smart. This is where everything goes down. Glenn Davis hits the shot. We've seen this all before. We get into a good position and everything goes wrong. Jabari Parker with the ball. He's going to get the screen. He's going to try to roll over. But nothing's going wrong this time. Jabari Parker hitting the game-winning buzzer beater in Game 7. Every young child's dream when they're dreaming about being a professional basketball player they step out on that court they're doing their practice shots they're going three two one jacking them up jabari parker has been going through his head since day one wanting to hit a shot like that this is one of the pinnacles of jabari parker's career and kevin love also having a huge impact he got a very well-rounded amount of shots uh, like I said, I mean, Dante Axum's injury is going to be a tough one to face. He was really the guy that's been leading this team. But we're going to figure it out. I'll catch you guys with game one of the next series. Peace. I'm out.